Gary, a good start, 5-2. I know you don't take much from the result, but you get to see the dynamics of the group and which, which players have good partnerships. Is that what you, you look to gauge from these sort of games? Yeah, I think the first the first couple of games, really, it's very difficult to even. You almost don't want to look at the result. Of course, you want to win games, but you don't want to look at the result. You want to look at some of the issues. And, and actually, what you tend to find in these games is you focus more on the things that players don't do, <coughs> which is a typical negative manager. But um, And there are lots of things to work on, you know. Um, but... We did some good things. Uh, it's, it's an element of fitness as well. The players are all running afterwards. The players are all doing strength and conditioning this afternoon. So it's just part of the training session. Um, but there's some pleasing things. It's sometimes, I think it's sometimes difficult when you're piecing two teams together because you know if you, if you were to put out your strongest team, it would look very much yeah. different. But, but, um, but actually, the players on the whole acquitted themselves pretty well. 22 players, 45 minutes each. It's a good stepping stone to move on to, to bigger things over the coming weeks. Yeah, it is. It's a good stepping stone. It's a good start. Um, the under-23s are playing an internal game with the 18s this afternoon, which will also be good for us to look at some of those players. Um, and then we'll move forward Saturday a little bit further. But I always take the first couple of games, two 45 minutes um, for each of the players. Mm. More really about fitness, less about the result. Um, more about just an early look at one or two things and how that relates from training into match play because of course you can see good training players mm. and sometimes they'll play a different way in, in matches um, but they've took on some of the principles we've, we've worked on um, and not done some of them as well as we'd like but that's what it's about I know you said you take the negatives more so than the positives, but one of the positives, Benny Kafobi, you can certainly see what he's going to bring to the table already. Yeah, Benny, look, I mean, he's a, he's a, he's a goal scorer. Um, you know, he probably should have had a few more, um, but he'll run him behind and he's one of those players that wants to stretch defenders. And, and, and you had very, two very different type of striking um, options there, I think, with Sido and Crouchy. Sido, you know, very clever in the pockets and Crouchy scores his goal in that position just behind the centre half on the angle. So um, we've got we've got different types of players and that's what you want. You want different options. Um, but certainly uh, we know what top player Benick is and, and uh, he's blaming the pitch. He thinks the pitch was a bit dry or he reckons he'd have probably scored two or three. <laughs> Walks on Saturday then off to Germany for a week. What Where do you expect to be at the end of that trip? Uh, I expect to be just a little bit further on than where we are now. Again, I've, I've had pre-seasons where you've won every game, start the season really badly. I've won... I've had pre-seasons where you've hardly won a game and everyone's doom and gloom and then we start the season unbeaten. So I don't read too much into it. It's more around assessing the group a little bit more and a little bit more critically. Um, it's about, you know, can we add some players to that group to, to strengthen it even more? And you can see even in those games where we're a little bit short of, of options or of, of, of the type of player we'd like. Um, but again, it's, you know, I'd expect it to be a little bit fitter, a little bit sharper. I think the first two games is difficult because you, you're always training, you're always doing double sessions, you're always doing a lot of physical work. You could save the players a little bit and get a better performance, mm. but you might not get a longer term um, base of fitness. So, um, you know, but we look forward to Saturday, it'll be a different test. I'm sure Walsall will move the ball really well and it'll be um, a more difficult test again. But that's what we want.